Roy Topley was perhaps the face of the ongoing drug problem that was plaguing the NBA during the mid to late 1980s. Uh, of course, along with other players such as Quentin Daly, Mike Ray Richardson, and a player that didn't even make it to the NBA, the late Lynn Bias. Roy Topley died today due to liver failure at the age of 50. Perhaps the liver failure was related to the long-standing drug and alcohol issues that he had throughout his life. Uh, earlier in his career, Roy Topley showed promise. He once won the NBA Sixth Man of the Year Award during the 1987-88 season. He held career averages of 12 points and about 10 rebounds per game. And for a stretch, he looked like he was on his way to being perhaps one of the premier centers of the NBA. He had an all-around game, but he never could quite get it together. And uh, he only wound up playing altogether a little bit less than six seasons in the NBA. He had some success uh, playing overseas in Europe, but he never became the player that he could have been. Roy Topley could have been perhaps one of the 60 to 70 greatest players that have played in the NBA. But sadly today, Roy Topley passed away at just age 50. Rest in peace.